So the Canadian Red Cross has been working with the Ethiopian Red Cross since 2014, um, predominantly on a program focused on building the capacity of the local Red Cross society, the Ethiopian Red Cross, um, to better respond to these kind of you know, disasters or these kind of situations. Um, we've actually decided to scale up our response given because of the situation and the worsening um, of the drought in the south and southeast of the country. So in the Walaita zone, uh, which is in the SNMPR region, uh, we're looking at focusing on addressing the immediate water needs of the population in that area. Uh, so we're, we're looking to truck water to where the people need it most, uh, it, both for their animals but also for, you know, for, the, for the people. If you travel to this part of Ethiopia, you'll see there's very little grazing uh, ground for animals. And one of the interventions, one of the p activities that we're supporting the Ethiopian Red Cross is providing uh, livestock with fodder, with grass for them to eat, to make sure that the condition of the animals d doesn't deteriorate any further. Uh, as I said, these are the, you know, this is key to their livelihoods, and not only the immediate their immediate needs, but also their longer term needs. If they lose their animals, then they lose their means of earning a living, and um, you know, the future of their families and uh, their communities will be at risk.